Good morning, it's day two and uh, we slept in. It's about 8.30 in the morning. We came in about 12.30 at night. We're in this rest area. Lots of other people, by the way, stayed here. Uh, there's somebody in a travel trailer they spent here. This was all filled with vans and trucks and cars. Uh, many people spent in the night last night. Um, well, we got places to go, things to do. So, come on along. Okay, we're about a mile off I-65, first stop of the day, Munfordville, Kentucky, and this is Kentucky Stonehenge. That's right, local guy built this replica of Stonehenge in his front yard. All right, stop number two is the National Corvette Museum in Bowling Green, Kentucky. Why Bowling Green, Kentucky for this museum? Well. This is where they build the Corvette. The Corvette, of course, has been an American automotive icon since 1953, and here's where they're built, in Bowling Green, Kentucky. They do tours here for 10 bucks each. We were gonna take one, but, well, they don't allow any cameras in, so bye-bye, Bowling Green. Bo isn't done with Bowling Green. He's getting a little antsy, and we're taking him to an off-leash dog park. Bo loves to make friends at the dog parks. Oh, he's going to get some exercise, some playtime. Doesn't get any better than this. Bo likes to play keep away. So he's found this big ball. He'll run all day with that. This is downtown Nashville, and though it always isn't possible, we do our best to avoid rush hour traffic. So as much as possible, plan ahead, try to avoid those rush hours. You'll learn that real quick. It's noon right now, and uh, we're able to move pretty good on the road. Right soon to change to I-40 towards Memphis. There are road trips, and then there are pilgrimages. This is a pilgrimage. This is the Jack Daniels Distillery in Lynchburg, Tennessee. This is Cave Creek. It's the water source for that smooth Tennessee whiskey. The visitor center has historic displays as well as you can take a tour with or without tastings. I like downtown Lynchburg where you can play a little checkers with the locals and uh, check out the Jack Daniels stuff. Your move. Your move. Your move. We have found spring, and here is the first sign of it. The Persithia is starting to bloom in southern Tennessee. And another sure sign the daffodils are blooming. Our job is it, done. We have found spring. We have found spring. 690 miles from our home in Detroit. Right about pretty much on the southern Tennessee, northern Alabama line. Spring has sprung. We're heading to Florida. We hope to find summer. <laughs> <laughs> We're Mike and Jennifer Wetland. Thanks for riding with us.